What's going on YouTube? Geosna right here. So in today's video I'm going to show you how to jailbreak iOS 14.0 on some of the devices that are supported. This video is brought to you by Anyfix, a software that allows you to fix iOS and iPadOS errors. It allows you to put your device in recovery mode, upgrade, downgrade, reset your device and of course fix iTunes issues. Check it out in the link below. So as you're probably aware the Checkrain jailbreak version 0.11.0 beta has been released yesterday and it supports iOS 14 on some devices. So the initial support is for the iPhone 6s, the iPhone 6s Plus, the iPhone SE, iPad 5th generation, iPad Air 2, iPad mini 4, iPad Pro 1st generation and Apple TV 4K and Apple TV 4. It's also supporting the iBridge T2. So if you want to jailbreak iOS 14 on any of those devices right now, all you have to do is to navigate to checkray.in which is available down below in the description and of course press download for Mac OS. If you need the Linux version you press see all downloads in here and you select one that is appropriate for your device. Probably x86-64 would work for you. If you have a Raspberry Pi or something that runs ARM, you may need those in here. So yeah, once you have it, it looks like this. As you can see, my iPad mini 4, which is a supported device, is connected and it's running iPadOS 14.0 as can be seen from here. And of course, since this is a supported device, all I have to do is to press start and in here it says that the device needs to be put in DFU mode. But first, it will be put in recovery mode. So press next and the device will enter recovery mode, which is a mode that looks like this. Alright, so it says device is now in recovery mode. Now you need to take your device and of course follow the procedure on the screen. You have to basically put the device in DFU mode, so you press start and follow the procedure. In my case is the home button at the same time with the power button. And as you can see it says device entered DFU mode and it says booting. Now the device is booting and it shows of course the Apple logo and the Checkrain logo and now you should be jailbroken. We're going to wait for it to boot and after that we can install Cydia and tweaks and stuff like that. You should keep in mind however that this is a semi-tethered jailbreak which means that you're going to have to do this procedure in here every single time you reboot your device. So now the device has booted, let me go to the device and continue the process. Alright so as you can see I am running iOS 14, if I go here to the uh, settings and go to software update there's should be no update for me because of course I am already on 14. So yeah, you can see iPadOS 14.0. Right now, as you can see, I have the Checkrain logo in here. We open the application and we should be able to install Cydia no problem on iOS 14. So we press Cydia in here, we press install Cydia and we wait for it to download everything it needs. It's basically the same procedure if you had used Checkrain before. I just want to show you the procedure in case you are a newcomer in the jailbreak community and you don't know how to do it. So at this point everything is being downloaded and it will be installed. It says in here downloading Cydia and now it's installing the Cydia and after that of course we will be good to go. So that's basically how you jailbreak iOS 14. The check rain is the first jailbreak for iOS 14 to be publicly released. So as you can see now Cydia runs. We probably do have some updates. Yes we do. Upgrade Essential. We press confirm and everything will start downloading in here. So yeah that's basically it. This is how you jailbreak iOS 14. You can see it works, it installs the packages and yeah we have a jailbreak for iOS 14 on select devices just days after the iOS 14 release. Thank you for watching, I am Geosnow, till the next time subscribe to stay updated and peace out.